All right, nerds. Oh, wow. It feels pretty good to be back. So, um, for those of you who follow me on Twitter, uh, you know that I was on vacation last week, uh, which is why I didn't have any videos. Um, I was up visiting my kid up in Pennsylvania, which was quite nice to see him. And uh, let's see, just a little bit of an adjustment there. Um, it was a lot of fun because he collects cards too, so it was a fun little thing for us to do together. I bought him an entire booster box of Ancient Origins, and he loved it quite a bit. And uh, it was actually pretty cute. One of his um, friends he hangs out with when I was trying to show him the uh, pack trick actually uh, actually understood it. So um, that was pretty neat. Uh, either way, so let's see. Uh, starting for this week, I want to start off this week with a new, cool new product called the Mega Mystery Power Box. A bunch of these have already gone up. Uh, I would have gotten this up last week had I been, you know, not on vacation, but unfortunately I was. And it's pretty cool. It's the newest version of the Mystery Power Box. And it contains a lot more stuff. Uh, if you know the old one, I got this one over here, this older one, with uh, I got a bunch of like loose cards in there that I just needed to get out of the way because I ran out of storage space. But um, this came with you know your five booster packs and a bonus item, which was uh, you know just a, a silly coin, <laughs> a coin that we all have a million of. And um, that was about it. You had a one in twenty. Now these ones have a guaranteed vintage pack in it as well. Um, as you can see, it shows a bunch of different stuff. I'm almost certainly going to get this Platinum Arceus. Uh, I'm not 100% sure. I think we see it right there. I'm not 100%. But either way, they always come seen with the same packs. You got the um, the uh, Phantom Forces uh, Flash Fire. That's another. That's a good thing to get. I mean, that's part of the appeal. Hey, we got a, we got another uh, um, Roaring Skies. These are all actually actually the back here shows you exactly what kind of packs you get. So it's all pretty neat stuff. You also get an oversized card, a code card, which is just like a random booster pack, and you get a random bonus item. Most people, it seems to be a keychain. Um, I've seen stickers. I've seen some pretty cool stuff. Uh, I'm Based on the sound of it, I think we got the keychain. There's a chance of a graded card, but I'm almost certainly not going to get it. And I think I'm about to sneeze here in a minute, so if you see a cut... I started sneezing. Either way, I want to open this thing up because I am pretty excited about it. Let me, oh, let me uh, arrange that a little bit better. Okay. And uh, just so you guys know, uh, I should be getting a mat sometime soon for... Um, I don't know exactly when I need to get that all figured out. But it just kind of depends on different things. And what kind of mat I'm going to get is going to depend on my funding over the next couple weeks. I'm completely broke. Thanks to uh, visiting my son. And if you guys haven't noticed, having kids is expensive. And I've had to spend a lot of money on stuff for my ex. So either way, let's open this thing up. Now, the only downside to this is that it's really, really expensive. Like, way too expensive for what it is. And uh, let's see, we got our Furious Fist. It's $50. Like, honestly, if this was if this was $25, this would be a guaranteed thing. Um, oh, there's our Platinum RCS pack. And there is our uh, guaranteed holofoil, and it's always some um, reverse. Like, I'm sure you can get a good one, but, I mean, you never do. And, uh, oh, that's a white code card. Maybe that's some good luck for our pulls. Evolutions pack, that seems to be a pretty common thing. So, Gary goes, you guys, take that one. Let me know what you get. And let's see what other cool items we've got in here. And uh, let's see what we got inside. Ooh. Oh, we got some cool stuff here. Oh, here's our oversized card, which, ooh, Mega Blaziken EX. I do not have this car, oversized card, so that's nice to have. Uh, and that seems to be a pretty common one to do. They always seem to be the Hoenn starters. They seem to be the common thing. And uh, let's see what else I've got in here. Oh, I got a lot of cool stuff in here. Oh. Anyway, so yeah, that's what I thought. Keychain, very neat. I'm actually not complaining. This is the one I wanted the most, other than, like, I w it would have been nice to get a graded card, but I didn't expect it. Of all the items people got a lot of, this is the one I wanted the most. So I'm happy to get that. Of course, you get your two little sampling packs, and these are pretty hard to come by. Oh, Noble Victories. I haven't seen anyone open one of these yet. So uh, these themselves are pretty, um, from what I said, the unopened packs are pretty hard to come by. They just contain common cards, though, so unfortunately, they're not going to be worth much once I open them up for you guys. So either way, let's get these packs out of here. And uh, let's 
see how we're gonna do this is we're going to open this and uh, let's put Sneasel aside you're not really really worth anything we're going to open these up in uh, order like I always do except for the um, except for the Platinum RCS I've never opened one of these packs before so that's gonna be set aside that's gonna be for last let's see but yeah flash fire came before for that and uh, I thought we'd get an XY base but I guess we didn't Ancient Origins. You know, it's something when the newest pack is a Roaring Skies pack, so that's pretty neat. Another kind of disadvantage here is that most of the stuff is like out of um, out of circulation. It's not for um, you know, out of a. Oh my God, it's not in play anymore. So either way, that kind of takes away from the value as well. So hopefully we get some good pulls to make up for some of that. Anyways, here's a flash fire code for you guys. Let me know in the comment section below what you get. Maybe you get that mega Charizard that people want. One, two, three to the front. Okay, and let's start with a pal pad. And uh, after this, I'll do those uh, black and white um, sampler packs, by the way. And then I'll do the RCS one last. Oh, gonna see. I am like out of out of it from doing videos. So, magnetic storm, Buniri. Helioptile, Geodude, Caterpie, Gumi, a reverse is a Litleo, cool card, but not exactly what I wanted, and a Butterfree, regular, rare, so no dice so far. Uh, we got a few more packs to go through, and I got a funny feeling this is not going to be worth the money I paid for it. Let's see if I get something decent out of this Furious Fist packs. Uh, she said, lying to herself. Alright, um... This is definitely my least favorite set, at least from the XY set so far. Um, you know what? Go ahead. Take that code. I'm going to give you guys all these codes. Why not? I feel generous today. One, two, three. First time back. It's been a while, so I might as well give you guys some extra codes, right? All right, so we're starting off with an Herbal Energy. Clefable. Tool Retriever. Electabuzz. Trap Inch. Noibat. Lickitung. Bellsprout. Our reverse is a Scorpy, which is just an uncommon, and our rare is just a Tyrantrum regular rare, because why not? Okay, two packs in. No decent pull so far. Oh my god. You know, if I get nothing, I better get like a Shaman or something at the end of this, so I don't know. Either way, there you go, guys. Give yourself a Phantom Forces booster. I hope you enjoy that. And uh, hopefully this thing's recording. Why is my nose in my last few videos? Uh, for some reason, when I recorded them all in bulk, my mic gave out at some point, and I had to use my um, camera audio, uh, which required quite a bit of um, quite a bit of a uh, editing to make sound decent. So, Puchina, Swirlix, Wismer, Aloamola, Dimension Valley. I don't know if that's any good. And our rare is just a Pachirisu regular rare. So three pet dud packs. Absolute. This is just an absolute dud box. This isn't even anywhere near worth the money that I paid for this. So, jeez. Uh, and it's not even good that it's a white code card because this set had all white code cards. There we go. Ancient Origins. One, two, and three to the front. Okay, let's see if we can get something decent out of here. At least get a hollow. Or a reverse rare would be nice. I'll take that. Whimsicott. Energy Recycler. Baltoy. Malamar. Gumi. Whooper. Magikarp. Our reverse is a Baltoy, and our rare is just a Falcarona. Regular rare. This is just the worst. Oh my god. <sighs> Jeez. Like, people got such good pulls out of these, and I'm just sitting here in absolute misery. Anyways, there you guys go is a Roaring Skies. One, two, three to the front. Well, oh, come on. Just Roaring Skies. Give me something decent. Healing Scarf, Shell Gun, Switch, Dratini, Cascoon, Halucha, Wingull, Inkay, our versus Wormpool, and our rare. Unpheasant. Uh, <laughs> guys. Oh my god, please be a hollow in here. Okay, no, let me open these first. Just, just, this is just gonna be my, um. <laughs> this, this is gonna be my palate cleanse. Guys, what the hell? I paid $50 for this. Oh my god. I can't believe I spent money on this. <laughs> 
Come on, come on, please le le be something decent. Let's see, we got ourselves, well, we got one of those things. We got Tyanimo, Timber, and Litwick. So, all common stuff. He has two commons and an uncommon. No, no, all three commons. So, at least they're kind of cool looking. You know, no expectations out of these packs. I got a bunch more stuff to open. I hope it's good. I got some black and white packs I will be opening in the next couple of days. You might have saw I posted those a uh, couple, um, oh, jeez. <laughs> like a week or so ago, I posted a picture on my Twitter showing that I gotten two really cool blister packs of black and white. So, oh, that's pretty neat. I wish I could have got, you know, you can get like all three starters. That would be pretty cool. I mean, especially for a sampling pack. But beyond that, it's not bad cards. It's just nothing that's exciting. So anyways, we got ourselves our Platinum RCS packs here. This is one of the older packs I've opened. I haven't opened any from the Platinum series, so that's pretty neat. Oh, goodness, yeah, this is uh, maybe the second oldest pack I've opened on this channel. The oldest being a jungle pack. I think, um... God, these feel so thick, too. Like, I know these cards... I think it was just with XY when the quality lowered. Because the black and white cards do always feel a lot thicker. And these don't have code cards. I do apologize in advance for not being able to give you a code card from this. But, you know, I gave you that uh, bonus uh, <laughs> code card. That, so you still got you still got an extra code card there, guys. So. Alright, so we're starting off with a Bronzor. The one good thing about this pack is I don't have any of these cards. <laughs> Professor Oak's Visit. Come on. Energy Restore. Gwynary. Electrite. Pikachu. Ghastly. Well, I'm never going to do that again. Uh, Burmy. Our, oh, Grovile, which is only an uncommon, but that's still pretty cool. And our rare is a Gengar regular rare, so I didn't even get a hollow out of that. Okay, so worst pack opening ever. Oh my god, a complete dud box. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe I spent money on that. Oh my god. Oh man, I had such high hopes for the pups too. I wanted to open it so bad, and oh my god, it was just crap, crap. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. Oh, you know what? It, I, it can't get any better, worse than this. Uh, whatever packs I got a beware box coming. I got a Mimikyu pin collection coming. That you know, remember the last one I opened? I lost the video. I got another one of those. I got some way other cool stuff coming up within the next two weeks. Um, I have some older videos that I never uploaded that I'm going to be uploading uh, next week, which should be following as this comes up because I will be um, broke. I won't have a paycheck because I my vacation was unpaid. So uh, fortunately, I will have enough so I can do three videos this week and next week, hopefully. So that way, there's still going to be some good stuff coming your guys' way, even if some of it's a little bit older content. Um, Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, maybe you guys enjoyed seeing me cry over all the money I spent on stuff that doesn't pan out. I do this mostly for you guys anyways. These boxes aren't worth it. Uh, the only way this box really would have been worth it is either A, you get some amazing pulls out of those packs, or B, you pulled a base set pack, because a base set pack was worth the cost of the box. So, um... I'm going to go cry in a corner now before I can film my next video. This is horrible. I feel, I genuinely feel bad. So, all right, nerds. I uh, hope you guys have a good day.